Hello, in this video, I would like to show you how to sketch some graph. For example, we have fx equals to 1 plus x, where x is between 0 until pi, and fx equals to pi, where x is between pi until 2 pi. So, what you have to do first, you can draw the sketch, uh, sorry, the axis. This is the x axis, and this is our fx. And then from the first function, since this is a piecewise function, we have 1 plus x for 0 until x. So we just substitute x equals to 0. When x equals to 0, 1 plus 0 equals to 1. So when x is 0, fx is 1. So this is the first point. And then when x equals to pi, let's say this is pi, x equals to 1 plus pi. And this is, let's say, 1 plus pi. 1 plus pi is about 4.142 something. So this is 1 plus pi. So just draw a straight line since we know that this is a linear. And then when x equals to pi until 2 pi, the function equals to pi. Pi is about 3 point something. So this is pi. And then this is our fx equals to pi until pi so that's all this is our graph next example now we have fx equals to modulus of x cube where x is between negative 2 pi until 2 pi so we know that fx equals to x cube the graph would be like s so let's say we have curve here as something like that. Okay. But since we have a modulus, we have a modulus. So it will reflect on this x axis. Whatever below the x axis, it will reflect. So we'll have like this. Therefore, fx equals to modulus x cube. Our graph would be looks like uh, quadratic. Something like quadratic. So we know that this graph is an even function because it reflects on y axis. This is an even function. Okay, let's look at this one last example. So we have here a function, a piecewise function for fx, and fx is a periodic function with period three. Sketch the graph of fx on the interval negative two until four. So given our fx is a piecewise from negative 1 until 1. Let's sketch our first graph for negative 2 until 1. When x goes to negative 2, so let's look at the first function. When x goes to negative 2, so we have negative 2, negative 1, 1 and 2. 1, 2, negative 1. Okay. When x is negative 2, so negative 2 plus 2 equals to 0. When x equals to negative 1, so 2 minus 1, 1. So this is our first line of, of x plus 2. Next function, fx equals to 1 for x negative 1 until 0. For x negative 1 until 0. Graph equals to 1. Okay. And the third function is 1 minus x for x equals to 0 and 1. So when x equals to 0, 1 minus 0 equals to 1. 1 minus 1 equals to 0. When x equals to 1, okay. So 1 minus 1 equals to 0. So this is our graph for negative 2 until 1. But we want to sketch our graph for negative 2 until 4. Since this is period 3, okay, from negative 2 until 1, period equals to 3, and then we have to extend our graph until 4. 2, 3, and 4. So we just have to repeat our graph. From 1 until 2 should be at 1, and then straight line, and then another straight line. Okay. So this is the 
repeated graph should be the same with the previous and if you can see this graph is not an odd nor even function because this graph doesn't reflect on the origin therefore it's not not an odd function also it does not reflect on the y axis therefore also not an even function therefore this is neither odd nor even function so that's all i hope you get the idea on how to sketch a graph when given a function and the intervals the most important is you have to know the shape of the functions and then just substitute the value of x into the function just do a lot of exercise on sketching and i'm sure you will master it